Hey, good morning, everybody. It is Nugget of Truth time with Pastor Matt on a Monday morning. I don't remember the date. What is it? Oh, it's uh, November 23rd, and we are on Nugget number 176. This is not going to be a very popular Nugget. I'll just say that up front right now. All right, unpopular Nugget number 176. Well, they all haven't been unpopular, but this one might be. All right, nugget of truth, number 176. One of the greatest hindrances to spiritual growth and maturity is financial stability. It keeps us from living lives of total dependence and wholehearted trust in God. It deprives us of our need. Well, I think we probably said it before uh, in the Old Testament when uh, God gave the people, the Hebrew people, manna. He just gave them enough for that day, and they wanted to store up extra, but it didn't work out well when they did that because they felt like, and you know, you can't blame them for wanting to have some stability of where their food is going to be uh, tomorrow, the next day. God wanted them to live in total dependence on him each and every day. We don't understand that for the most part. Um, You know, obviously we do have people in need, and you might have had times of need in your own life, obviously. I don't want to discount any of that. But we also have a built-in safety net that helps us with a lot of those different things. Uh, Some of our folks, a couple of them have really gotten involved helping out with the local migrant uh, community across the river. And those folks have more of a daily need, but... For most of us, we really don't understand what it means to have um, a daily dependence on God. And um, throughout human history, uh, I think for a huge percentage of our human history, people have almost had a daily sustenance dependence. And um, they depended on God so much more. But the more wealth that we have, the more stuff, the bigger our bank account, obviously, the more we can, it's human nature just to kind of rest and relax. And and think about it. When have you really experienced some sort of need for God? So it wasn't a financial need, but, you know, a a bad diagnosis or, um, you know, something going on in your family relationship wise. And what drives us to our knees is our need. And um, so, yeah, this is a challenge for us. Uh, it's a challenge. We we live in America. We have so much. It's Thanksgiving week. We're we're supposed to spend some time being grateful um, for all that we have. But we need to recognize that all these blessings that we are grateful for really do make it hard for us to live in total dependence and trust in God. And um, so that's something we need to be aware of and and just continue to lean into. So, all right. Take care. God bless. Have a great day. Bye.